Oh, hey, what's going on? Paul Guy here. Uh, it's been a while since we uh, had a video on this channel addressing you guys, uh, but I figured uh, I'd make something to just kind of say hi, what's going on? And uh, yeah, just a quick little fun video um, to let you guys know that we're alive. Uh, the last video we posted was, um, it was a duel, a Yu-Gi-Oh duel between uh, Mark and I which Mark completely steamrolled me um, in grand fashion. But um, I decided, you know, just I wanted to make a fun video just to kind of put something out there. And, uh, you know, it's been, a, it's been a while since I've done anything here. So uh, I figured the best thing to do since the last video was a Yu-Gi-Oh! one was perhaps maybe opening some Yu-Gi-Oh! packs. I got uh, four Maximum Crisis because there is a particular card that I'm after and it's in this series so uh, rather than spending a crap ton of money on a big box and just opening up a bunch I just figured maybe buy a few and try my luck. You never know, the Paul luck likes to kick in whenever it wants. Um, and uh, I don't really have a huge setup so this is going to be very amateur looking but you know whatever we're doing it live man. Let's just get into it. Let me just get the and I gotta hold this upright because I did try doing a video like this before and I cocked my phone to the uh, side here. I got a nice little setup actually right over here. Yeah, I got my new Chrome Amiibo, Tiki Amiibo, and then I got like my Playmats. I got a Pixel Tactics one, which of course, the Pixel Tactics and Ascendance is covering, but then this is my uh, my game board, game mat or the Mega Man one, which is the greatest one, better than yours. I don't care, I'll fight you. All right, so let's get into it. So the card we're looking for is Ash Blossom and Joyous Spring. I believe that's the thing. Um, it's a $70 card too. So uh, yeah, let's hope we get it, shall we? Um, didn't really think about the opening of the pack. So uh, I'm gonna put you in darkness real quick. Doing it live. Oh yeah, it's here it open. It looks so good. And then, okay, we're just gonna slide it right there and then we're just gonna unveil one at a time. So we got ourselves Bug Signal, uh, Venue, Bright Bird of Divinity. I'm trying hard not to like spoil any of like the good stuff if it comes up. Spiral Mission Rescue, Ooh, what's this? It's a DDD Stone King Darius. Mark would like that because he has a DDD deck. Just keep feeding my friends cards. And what do we got here? We got Spiral Sleeper Ooh, for those spiral decks, which I do not have. Artifact Var Vajra. Form Pal Review Dancer. Oh, that's a lot of stars. Subterra Behemoth Sp Sp Spadogeist. And Supreme King Dragon Dark Worm. All right, so we didn't get Ash, but that's fine. Uh, we got three more to go through. Let's, uh, let's hope, shall we? Taking a plunge. And you can hear everything, so, you know, it's... Uh, you know that's what's happening. So let me place that right there. Yeah. Okay. So we got Disciples of the True Draco Phoenix. Interesting cards right there. Uh, Lyralisk Turquoise Warbler. That's a weird word right there. Uh, Dino Mist's Howling. Mm -hmm. uh, BES Big Core Mark III. Yeah, I've heard about these ones, like the big space shooter ones. Oh, oh, apparently I'm just skipping ahead here. Zephrath? Um, what is this? True Zephra? I don't know. I don't know what the archetypes are, whatever. Another Performer Pell Dancer, another Sub Terror, um, Dark Worm, and a BEF. Did I, like, miss one of those? I probably did, whatever. Hey, what are you doing? Alright, so, pack number three. Uh, Darkness. Da -da 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 -da. No parents! Da, da, da. Lego movie, anybody? Pack number three. So we got another uh, Lyralisk Warbler. Uh, Zodiac Gathering. Okay, that's cool. Ooh, Zodiac Caterus. Like this big Zodiac card. Bao Baboon. Bao Baboon. Bao. I never knew how to say that one right there. Uh, pendulum Switch. For good old Pendulum Dexon. Ooh, this one's shiny. This one's really shiny. Unending Nightmare. 
what's this say? If you pay a thousand life points, then target one face-up spell or trap card on the field, destroy it. Oh, and you only activate this effect once per chain. Oh, so that's a, I imagine that being a very situational one. I'll have to sleeve that one for later. Um, Magician's left hand, Speedroid, Malicious Magnet. Oh, that looks gnarly. And of course, another Dark Worm. No Ash Blossom, but we have one more to get through. Here we go. One more plunge this into darkness for you guys. And I unpack this last one, place it right here. Okay, Disciples of the True Draco Phoenix. Uh, Speedroid Skull Marbles. Oh, that's an interesting card there. Another Bob -ba -ba Baboon. Mm, weird. Oh, this is the Performer Pal Coin Dragon. That oh, looks rather goofy. Ooh, hello. Fairy Tale Luna. One of the Fairy Tale cards. If this card is normal summon, you can add a spellcaster type monster with 1850 attack from your deck to your hand, which I'm assuming is another one of these. Uh, once per turn, you're the player's turn, you can target one face-up monster your opponent controls you. Opponent can send one card with that monster's name from their deck to negate this effect. Otherwise, return both this card and that monster to the... Oh, that's actually not bad. Hmm. I might try to use that in something, possibly. And then what else we got here? And then I got another Dark Worm, Primal Cry, uh, Subterror, and another Lyralisk. We unfortunately didn't get Ash Blossom today, but we got some couple pretty decent, cool-looking cards. Um, not to take anything away from the shiny stuff in there, but what do I know? This is probably like the big one right here, Unending Nightmare. But uh, eh, I assume like once per chain, you could probably means like once, whatever. I don't know. I'll have to look into that. But maybe Mark knows. Anywho, uh, hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, I was expecting to hop up and down for joy for getting a $70 card, but obviously it's very expensive for a reason, but you know, whatever. But this is just a little goofball video I wanted to make just to, for the sake of it. Um, yeah, so I mean, if you guys uh, liked that, you know, let me know. I wouldn't mind doing like some openings. It's sort of a thing to do, you know. Uh, I know Mark and I haven't done like any big Let's Plays lately. Um, it's been very difficult to kind of like get our schedules aligned, but uh, you know, we're still thinking about it. And we always think about this channel and we think about you guys. I know it seems like this channel might be a far cry from uh, possibly being saved or even being anything else big at this point, but you know, it's, it's still in our hearts and something that Mark and I like a lot. So uh, we just, I don't know. I just figured, just keep a keep a keep her foot in the door. Just old friend saying hello type thing, you know. So uh, hopefully you guys enjoy the video. Leave a like, subscribe if you want to. I mean, if you really want to, that's up to you. Um, yeah, and until next time, see you guys.